Hi, Jack. How are you? I'm good. How are you? I'm doing great. I loved Ron's Gone Wrong. I thought it was like such an incredibly complex story for what you would think, you know, is for kids. Um, So for you, what was your way into the character of Barney? How did you most relate to him? It was, it was so natural. I mean, I didn't have to put too much, I don't mean to sound like a a brat, but I didn't have to put too much work into it. I mean, that's not true. I put a lot of work and a lot of heart and soul and everything because I worked on this movie for for so long. Like, like since I was 13, I've been working on this movie. Oh, wow. Oh my God. Like five years. Uh, It's been, it's been a big, a long process. And, Mm -hmm. uh, and it it means so much to me that it's actually, it's coming out now. Mm -hmm. It's like, it's so near and dear to me, this, this, this film. And, um, so I, I mostly related to, to Barney. When I first read the script, the thing that, the thing that initially can, compelled me so much, captivated me, was, was Barney and how much I related mm. to him. And being, uh, I think I just got out of middle school, middle school and I was starting high school. And I couldn't wait for high school because middle school sucked. And high school is <laughs> much better. Uh, middle school was so bad. And I remember there's a scene in, in the movie where he's going to recess. And I remember the dreaded recess. I remember mm. that. And I remember not having the thing that everybody else had, like, or whatever, whatever it was, AirPods or I don't know. Mm-hmm. I didn't have it. <laughs> so, um, yeah. Yes. I, I distinctly remember those days as well. That was very relatable. <laughs> yeah. Now, over the course of those five years, how much did you get to kind of play with the dialogue or the dynamics of uh, Barney in the recording studio or talking with uh, directors? Well, my voice changed a lot mm-hmm. and that was a big, that was like the biggest challenge I'd say is having to match my 13 year old voice as an 18 year old. <laughs> it's definitely a challenge. I, I, I my, my, voice didn't, my, my voice still isn't like an adult voice, but it definitely is different from when I was 13, when it was like a beetle voice, like a little buzzing beetle or whatever, the highest pitch. <laughs> ever. Definitely. Did you get to play off of the other actors or were you mostly working with the directors? Mostly working with the directors, but however, I did cool uh, cool experience. I did get to do a session with Zach twice. I, oh. so that was fun. <laughs> did you, you don't usually get the opportunity to do? Right, right. Did you get to learn any uh, improv trips tricks from one of the masters? Uh, no, but I I am pretty good at improv. So uh-huh. we 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 improvised together and. Mm-hmm. Um, it was fun. It was really fun. I it was it, I was shocked that I walked away and I realized like I, I just kept up with Zach Alphanakis at improv. We had good. <laughs> we kept up. I kept up with him. That was insane. Yeah, so, yeah. That's that's a claim to fame right there. I that was that. an achievement. My biggest. <laughs> achievement. Um. Obviously, the dynamic between Barney and Ron is the heart of the story, but uh, his family life is also very heartwarming while simultaneously embarrassing can you talk yeah. about how he feels in his family uh, he knows there's love and he loves his family he loves his family so much it's different from feeling at school i mean the feeling he has at school at school he feels like he's in a fishbowl and he comes home and you know he's got a dad who loves him and he loves his dad and he loves his grandma but i think he doesn't think that anybody understands him and mm-hmm. so he's just like i'm not even going to try to explain anything just because i'm i'm like i'm showing my own head anyway i don't want to stress anybody else out he's just like and that's kind of how i am as well Aww. you know when i'm feeling really stressed like I'm not, I'm not gonna like go i mean i like to vent i love coming home and venting to my mom oh my god believe me <laughs> but i um you know i don't want to put mm-hmm. my stress on other people yeah and same with yeah. Same with barney barney the same mm-hmm. way Oh, well, hopefully both of you learned to express yourselves over the course of the film. (laughs) Uh, I cannot wait for everyone to watch it. I had so much fun with it. So I hope you have a great day. You too.